Jimmy's Pub, we're ready to start. Uh, thanks for being patient. We have a really super show. Uh, these guys are going to be touring in Australia. They're leaving in two weeks, so anybody going down to Australia in the next six or seven months, look for them. Uh, if you can't afford the airfare, they're going to be at the Comedy Nest until Sunday night from Toronto. Please welcome Corky and the Juice Pig. <laughs> Sunday he was talking to the masses. Monday he was raising up the dead. Tuesday he was turning water into Beaujolais. And he said we had a choice of white or red. Wednesday he was walking on the water as he helped my father fix our swimming pool. Thursday I saw him down by the dick and head, but he couldn't find a place to park his mule. The man who thinks he's Jesus lives next door to me. The man who thinks he's Jesus fixed my color TV. Tell the body I try to give him loonies, but they fall right to his wrist. With just an ounce of vodka, he can get 5,000 pissed. He always heals my grandma, although she's never sick. If you want 2,000 lepers, he can get them really quick. The man who thinks he's Jesus lives next door to me. The man who thinks he's Jesus fixed my color TV. I always invite him over to play Monopoly, but he's afraid we'll take his robe away if he rolls number three. He has a funny penchant for wearing a crown of thorns, but I don't really care as long as he fixes grandma's corns. Dance, dance, wherever you may be. I am the Lord of the dance, said he, and I'll lead you all wherever you may be, and I'll come to your house, and I'll fix your TV. That was Todd. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Thank you. Okay. Want to take a look at that? There you go. The song we'd like to play for you now is a song that comes from a time period they named the 50s. Now the 50s, as you all remember, was a time when everything seemed to remind you of your girl. That's very true. <laughs> for instance, um, your mom and dad. Your girl. A chocolate milkshake. Oh, your girl. <laughs> the drive-in movies. Oh, your girl. <laughs> a bald man with no eyebrows dancing naked on some broken glass screaming, The big bees, the big bees have eaten my mother! Your girl. <laughs> your girl. Your girl. That's right, fellas. Sometimes even your girl seems to remind you of your girl. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> so don't put me food on my burger, cause it reminds me of my girl. girl, girl. Don't put a big food on my burger, cause if you do, I think I'm gonna hurl. We drove into the drive. It was about a quarter past ten. She had to go to the little girl's room. She took the key, but it hung by the door. La, 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 ba, do, ba, do, ba, then I heard those pickled truck tires screeching. And I never saw my girlfriend anymore. <laughs> Don't put a big fool like my burger, because it reminds me of my girl. Oh, 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 oh. You can give me ketchup. You can give me mustard if you want to. You can give me a huge slice of meat from a dead monkey's bum, or a huge cup of moldy old cherry custard if you wanted to. You can give me two huge Mexican men with big windmills dangling from their nipples if you wanted to. Or you could give me plain Gretzky's left nut on a big piece of lettuce. But don't put a big fool on my burger, cause it reminds me of my girl. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, my God. 
Bob, are you? Just fine, Bill. But I see you have put on a little weight. Ever since you got your brand new... Gas barbecue! <laughs> Along with the year supply of Kingsford charcoal. Get the Kingsford edge, but I see you cruising down the street in your brand new car! Oh, uh, Chevy Vega! You launched incredible hatchback with reclining bucket seats and an AM, FM radio. But that is nothing. Compared to where you're doing! Go to my own town, that's it, go! I'll be spending seven days in six sensuous nights <laughs> at the beautiful Puerto Vallarta Hilton overlooking the exotic Gulf of Mexico. <laughs> Lunch and dinner not included there. I'll be in your right hand. I put a wheel between her legs. I used my grandma as a skateboard. We went up and down and we went round and round. We did the alley hop, we did the acid drop. Went down a hill and we took a spill. And now grandma is dead. Two Canadian game show announcers meet on the street. Hi, Bob, how are you? Yes, fine, Bill. But I see you have put on a little weight. Ever since you got your brand new McDonald's coupon! Uh, available in McDonald's franchises across Canada. But I see you cruising down the street in your brand new coat! Yeah! <laughs> it's a beautiful down tooth coat from Searsville. Who can stole the ravages of the winter weather, but again, that is nothing. <laughs> Compared to where you're going! Beautiful downtown Cornwall! <laughs> I'll be spending seven days and two sensuous nights at the beautiful Cornwall Motor Inn overlooking absolutely nothing. Bring your own lunch and dinner bill. Tiger Stripe pants in the drive. Cause tonight I'm gonna go downtown. I'm gonna set this rock and roll world on fire. Yeah, rock steady, rock steady. Mama, mom, get dinner ready. Rock steady, rock steady. Mama, mom, get dinner ready. Hey, Dad, you great big fat capitalist pig. Can I borrow the car? I'm gonna go downtown tonight and play some mean kick ass rock and roll guitar. Yeah. Rock steady, rock steady. Mama, yeah. mom, get dinner ready. Rock steady, rock steady. Mama, mom, get dinner ready. Hey, Pot. What? Pot's oh, late to over to a party my dad's having while my mom's away in jail. <laughs> Oh, I can't. I've got a big, uh, I've got a big water tennis uh, competition. I'm going. To. Oh, really? You're still working at the Y then? Yeah, that's right. Well, well, the last time I came over to your party, you know, I was kind of leery of going over because we took the snowmobiles out in the lake and we were burning around, and then we almost drowned because it was August. <laughs> so I remember, I remember that, that was the same summer that my dad got so stoned that he dressed up like a Pontiac Fiesta and drove around the block. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. But then when he woke up, he couldn't remember where he parked. <laughs> hey, Heinrich, Heinrich, hey, I heard yeah. you got a new job at McDonald's, man. That's right, they put me in charge of the deep fryer last oh, night. Prize possession. It was wonderful, and you know, I was drinking that Daniels that you gave me for Christmas, you know? What? Like, I drank so much, I think I puked into the deep fryer. <laughs> no, it's okay, because before anybody noticed, I put them into those little pie boxes. Yeah! Oh, rock steady, yeah. rock steady, yeah. while my mom gets dinner ready. Yeah. Rock steady, rock steady. Find a place to stop. Fall in 
new reality. A child was dropped hard. I just kicked her. <laughs> <laughs> There's two men walking down the street. There's one tall man and there's one short man. The tall man pulls a gun, the gun fires, and the short man drops dead. And who do you think killed him? My dad. My dad, he's a killer, my dad. My dad, he's a killer, my dad. My dad, he's a killer, my dad. He's a killer, killer too, I wrote that one from personal experience, thank you. <laughs> Live from the Olympics. Oh my God, Elvis, I'm sorry about the Jesus. <laughs> Live from the Olympic Stadium, 4,000 tons of raw power as the monster for my boys take on Bigfoot in an honor battle of the monster trucks. This ain't no mama's boy Sunday drive. Some go, but some blue. Live from the Olympic Stadium, watch as evil Knievel rides Don Knotts naked over the castle of Kajapo, and then come as nine ancient Greeks rise from the dead, say, God, we like eggs, cook them up, rub them on their bodies, and say, oh, my, my, Yoki, this is raw power. Live from the Olympic puppet factory and cafeteria French fry sandwich board nipple, this is 15,000 small chickens who dress up like Gary Coleman and walk around going trick or treat, smell my feet, give me a knife and I'll stick it in your back. This yeah. is 14,000 Todd Bridges impersonators climbing up Gary Coleman's buttocks and kicking himself to death. This yeah. is 1,400 pieces of luggage. Pat nit staunch my tooth. Yes! Yes! Live from Orson Welles' buttocks, yeah. six monkeys, all called Simon, cover themselves in a thick Beastly peanut butter and run down the street singing, Oh, if only we were simians. And then, out of nowhere, my mother takes her own leg, shoves it down her throat, and dances very complicated dances in her stomach. Then, out of nowhere, brilliant scientists, all covered with nun fluids, come from a dance and buy a huge chocolate bar and send it to the Asian dance squads. Then, out of nowhere, Ferris Bueller suddenly gets another day off and comes to my house and steals my furniture. Then, out of nowhere, Darts fly from the side of my window and pierce an old practicing pansy farm. Yeah. Alive from the Olympic Stadium! A love song. <laughs> love songs are your lovers, I guess. Lovers of peach, lovers of whale, lovers of pieces of whale. <laughs> this, this is Porvu. A love song. <laughs> we will be if you don't shut up. <laughs> Nuclear warheads and bombs heading towards our city. You're the only one on the subway car and right now you sure look pretty. <laughs> I'm not the kind of guy who believes in love at first sight. But when we glanced at each other just now, I thought, well, she's all right. Kiss me before we burn. Kiss me before we burn. Wrap your loving arms around me while you still got them. You look real cute in that green and pink polyester suit. <laughs> Have you thought about a nose job? Oh, that's not your nose. <laughs> Sorry. So you smell like cheese. Mm. And you're a bit flashy, but we still have 10 minutes left. I sure hope my friends don't see me. <laughs> Kiss me before we burn. Everybody, come on now. Kiss me before we burn. Wrap your loving arms around me while you still got them. And me and this elderly Chinese man will take turns. Ten, nine, eight. Gee, that up was great. Seven, six, five. We're still alive! Four, three, two. Hey, I love you. Come on. We're done like TV dinner. 
love song against nuclear holocaust. Thank you very much. We was bubble, but they don't fall down. 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 You can push them, you can shove them, but you just can't get them down. Weebles that have been on their feet all day. It doesn't matter if Weebles leave the toilet seat up. Whoa! Weebles who don't drink and drive. <laughs> Two weebles boxing. Bring it up, bring it up. Hit below the belt. Bring it up. Weebles. Weebles on a yacht. Hey, you guys. The Fisher Price people are puking again. A weevil's bubble, but they don't fall down. A weevil's bubble, but they don't fall down. Pick it up. We don't they don't fall down. We don't they don't fall down. You just can't get them down. Thought when cows laugh, there's milk come out of their noses too. Thought if Fred Flintstone could drive a car really fast with his feet, why didn't he just run everywhere he had to go? Thought if skinheads are such anarchists. Why do you always see them on the public transit system? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, for your pleasure, dining and dancing pleasure, I present to you the king of rock and roll, Mr. Elvis Presley! So I put on some weight. I wanted to do what I was reduced. So I bought on some khaki suit of blue. Oh, let him be. Whoever's brother, thank you very much. Well, I'll never do a movie. There's no sin and vice. I'll only do a movie. That's just plain darn nice. Hey, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Rock me, Elvis. The girls will fight to me. I want to do my K-Rock T. They'll show me that they are pleased. By dancing in their panties. serious problem. There's hundreds of midgets all over the world who are trying to grow mustaches. <laughs> and for some of them, there is no sunrise tomorrow. <laughs> you can help by sending $15 to, hey, sprout one, shorty, a non-profit organization. A nonprofit organization that helps midgets all over the world have a hairier tomorrow. 
please give generously, send right away, and you'll receive a photo of your midget <laughs> with a colorized retouched photo of what his mustache would look like <laughs> if he had one. Please, please send today to Sprout One Shorty, Box 221, Spark Street Mall, Ottawa, Canada. Because a midget would like to go to a disco and look good too. Well, we want to thank everyone for coming up to Reggie's here today. You know, we, we've been clear across this great nation of ours, all the way from Halifax to the coast of Vancouver Island there. And we see a lot of crazy things out there on the road. And we done wrote a song about it. Are you ready, boys? Yeah. One, two, oh, one, two, three. I'm a trucker, I'm a trucker. I keep this country rolling. I'm a trucker, I'm a trucker. I like beer and broads and bowling. from Phoenix Omaha I'm just a fool to sleep with the wheel and I kill Carlos of Turi yeah. I'm a trucker, I'm a trucker I keep this country rolling I'm a trucker, I'm a trucker I like beer and broads and bowling Let me talk to him for a while, dear Milton Well, you give him a lip smack, how do you do? Poke around the windmill, give him a dog Take him down to the bush and beat him with a stick I will, boy, I will Well, I ride down the road with my heavy load The highway's long and lonely So sometimes I pick up teenage hits, I get boys And I go to motel up as a Gideon Bible. And then when someone comes in to give me a good read, I fart real loud. <laughs> sometimes, sometimes I like to cover myself up in a nice homemade pistachio pudding. <laughs> sometimes I slip within the skin of a magic otter and I dribble, dribble, and then I walk over to a machine that sells some kind of snack. And I, I hold myself close to it, and at the last minute, I put in some change. Yeah! Now, now we, we don't want you to think that it's all fun and games out there in the road. No, 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 like there was this one time me and Milton here was at the top of a mountain pass. Cruising 90 miles an hour, we'll see, down the side of a mountain. We got chicken stacked oh, 30 feet high. But Milton here realizes that the brakes have given away. <laughs> and we were scared. Were we scared, Milton? <laughs> yeah. And Milton starts to scream like that, and I start to piss myself, and the cab's filling up with my ear, and I'm doing the press stroke over the gears, trying to find a runaway lead, trying to break it the gears. And we're picking up speed, too. We're going 300 million miles an hour down the side of a mountain. We got chicken stacked, oh, uh, four, 400 feet high. And then Milton here realizes that the only place we'll be able to stop is when we hit the wall of Mabel's coffee out at the bottom of the pass. And we were scared. We were scared, Milton. Ah! <laughs> and we're picking up more speed. We're going 1,500 billion, zillion, quarterillion miles an hour down the side of a mountain. We got chicken stacked to the moon. And then Milton here screams out terror as we hit the wall of Mabel's coffee out. And we pass the shoot-em-up in a machine for that old pigs or nothing, darn money. And we climb out of our cabs as we're standing over Mabel's greasy 400-pound corpse. And there is only one thing that we can think and one thing that we can say. I'm a trucker, I'm a trucker, I'm a man of the open road. I'm a trucker, I'm a trucker, could you make that pie out of wood? I'm a trucker, I'm a trucker, I keep this country rolling. Once upon a time, once upon a time, 
They were two merchants. Buy my things. No, buy my things. They were very competitive. Buy my things. You'll like them. Buy my things. You'll like them better. Each one was always trying to find new ways to outsell the others. Buy one of my things and I'll give you another one for nothing. <laughs> buy one of my things and I'll show you my daughter's bum. Hey. <laughs> they became more and more ruthless. Buy one of my things or I'll punch you in the dink. <laughs> buy one of my things or I'll show you my bum. Hey. <laughs> and soon they were at an impasse. Their competition could only lead to poverty. That's when one of them decided they should make a deal. This really stinks. Yeah, I know. Let's put aside our differences and cooperate. Okay. So thank they. You, so <laughs> they. Thank you, and you'll be going back if you don't <laughs> shut up. <laughs> Where was I? <laughs> we On just Sesame shake Street. Shake just oh, okay. Well. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> then the business boomed. The thing business never looked better. Yeah. That's when one of them decided to stab the other one right in the throat. Die, you bastard! <laughs> and he took all the money. The moral of the story? Don't yell out in the middle of the sketch. <laughs> <laughs> stupid doesn't necessarily mean he's a faggot. It's <laughs> a good hint, though. Thank you. Speaking, well, of, speaking of faggots, I feel the love flowing around the room, <laughs> sort of coming from this guy's half mustache down onto the table, uh, floating around. And I think it's time to do a tribute to a very talented songwriter, singer, dancer, juggler, skateboarder, ice cream salesman, and Nazi hunter, fugitive blogger. <laughs> this is our tribute to the very lovely and very, 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 ever so very talented, Suzanne Vega. <laughs> comes up behind him and goes <laughs> I watched the man as he turned away and I thought I heard him say <laughs> and the boy was puzzled he went into an ice cream store and said excuse me ma'am can I have an ice cream and the woman said yes no and so she gave him one and it melted, and there was a little tiny man in it, and he said, Hey, kid, do you want to be a Panzerotti? And the boy said, Yes, I do. I want to be a seafood Panzerotti with a big piece of cheese and a monkey that can wash me. <laughs> and everyone said, Morning is here. The dog has been washed. The freedom of night is gone. Are you lost in love just like me? members who fled the ancient tribune. I want to be more than your gardener. I want to be your loaf of bread. And you can cut me up and stick me in the toaster and toast me and spread all kinds of liquids on me. I'm going to develop a huge boil on my cheek and make it into a big flower shape and get my picture taken for Now Magazine. It's a magazine that everyone doesn't know about, <laughs> except me. In a way, I am everyone. I just pulled my scalp off and tied it back and had a little 
flower growing on top of my meaty head and then the door blew open and standing there Wyatt Earp and his sister searching for love just like me Hello, I'm Wyatt Earp and this is my sister sticking halogen lamps between her buttocks and making <laughs> pictures on her stomach. The glow would shine and we would come home all rosy and red from skating on the pond and she would beat us with a stick. I am sitting on the corner with the doctor in the mustache. He wishes he had done it, even though he has no friend. And I want to pour the milk, but I'm afraid there's going to be something inside that little pitcher. And I'm frightened of the dark. I am sitting on the corner with a porpoise with a friend who is dying for pneumonia. And he likes to borrow cheese. So I'm going to take him down to a market where he can buy French monkey dudes. I am a dog. Live my life in pain. Ho, 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 said the Santa at the mall. And I said, I love you, Santa. And then Santa slapped my face. And he said, Don't call me Santa. I am John Dingo Logie. I am for another woman. I've got to buy a bread. Oh, bread is the thing I love. I love that bread. It's crusty on the outside, and the inside is not. It's brown, 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 brown as a pygmy's elbow. Brown. Brown as a Turkish man's cigar, brown as fruit poop, brown as a teeter totter, brown as a monkey with an eye for fashion. Brown, yeah. brown, Suzanne Vega's brown. Thank, Thank you very you. much. Uh, two, 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 two dyslexic game show announcers meet on the street. Bob, how are you, Hal? Fine, just built. See, I wait for you a little. Barbecue since new brand, yes, yeah, got you, yours. Chuckle to play of the years, King Thrift with a long by Edge get King for the CU cruising butt eyes of the street down. You're in car new brand. Hey, go, shabby. Convertible back to luck patch. Seat pick lining with buckets and an FA M and M radio. But that is going nothing where you're compared to. Fire to Mexico, Puerto! <laughs> Seven six of the beautiful sensuous Hilton's burning four days by set by our tub. Young lad, dinner snot in a climb of the lip. Don't touch my grandma, she left me here. Don't, Don't touch, touch my grandma, grandma cause she, she drinks beer. <laughs> Gentlemen, stay away from my mouth. You're a weirdo. You're a weirdo. Gentlemen, stay away from my mouth. You're a weirdo. You're a weirdo. Jesus Christ. My dog has rabies. Won't you help me kill him, please? My dog has rabies. Now he's breeding killer fleas. And this, this is a favorite of Corky's that we used to play together when we played in Charles Manson 5. Psychopathic killer in the summertime. Psychopathic killer, oh yeah, oh yeah. Psychopathic killer in the summertime. Psychopathic killer, oh yeah, oh yeah. I want to poke your eyes out with that knife I found in your back! Take up at me, killer in the summertime. Take up at me, killer, oh yeah, oh yeah. Take up at me, killer in the summertime. Take up at me, killer, oh yeah, oh yeah. I wanna find your dismembered body in a garbage bag. Take up at me, killer in the summertime. Take up at me, killer, oh yeah. Take up at me, killer, oh yeah. Take up at me, killer, oh yeah, oh yeah. I like to put on my speedo and go swimming in your children's blood. Psychopathic, 
Hello, everyone. I'm that man's father. Yes, Mom. We have Renny Samart in the audience today, ladies and gentlemen. Hey, Renny. Oh, that's even worse than Faye. <laughs> in fact, I mean, what's so bad about Faye? It's really. And I think that you should all just smarten up, all right? And if you laugh at any kind of joke like that again, I think I'm going to have to come out, find your addresses, and beat the shit out of you. Because my sister's a fag. <laughs> and most of my friends are, and our Christmas tree this year was a fag. Good guess. What? You said good guess. I don't know what that means exactly. <clears throat> my sister is a fag. Good guess. She told me. I didn't have to guess. <laughs> That's for me, that's my sister. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, sis. I'll get back the pony. Hi. <laughs> my name's Barry Manilow. Thank you. And a lot of you remember me as the man who wrote the songs. But there's another, there's another side of me that a lot of you don't know about. And that's the fact that at birth I was completely turned inside out. That's right. The body you see today is an incredible computer reconstruction. <laughs> but there are millions of people who each day are turned inside out at birth. Perhaps they hook on to a bit of someone's hip bone and the rest is, is a painful history. So please, dig deep if you can. Because there's a lot of people who really can't wear any kind of clothing at all because it's very, very painful, and the pockets dig in. So please, dig deep into your pockets for them. And give $10 to, ooh, it's pink. That's right, $10 is all you need to do. Send it to 228 Spark Street Mall, Ottawa, Canada. You were turned inside out. I wouldn't touch you. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. We've noticed that there's a lot of anthem songs on the radio these days. There's a lot of Bruce Springsteen and a lot of John Cougar Mellencamp and a little bit of Bob Jovi still out there. So we decided to write an anthem song of our own. We decided to write an anthem song that summed up what Corky and the Juice Pigs is all about. And I think that what we came up with is a song sums up what each one of us here today is really all about deep down inside. Now this is the kind of song, hey, this is the kind of song, this is the kind of song that lets you do this at concerts. <laughs> Greeters, <laughs> greeters, <laughs> oh yes, <laughs> superb. Ow! So if you feel like doing that in the middle of the song, go ahead, don't be afraid, you won't be stupid. These two will be doing it as well. Okay, here we go. Ow! I looked out my window and what did I see? What did you see? Oh, nothing. I hadn't opened the curtains yet. How stupid of me. Wow. Well, I wanted to go drinking. Hey, baby, down by the levee. Hey. But I had to show up late to see. Because I got my legs stuck in the door of my Chevy. Because I'm young and stupid. I'm so young and stupid. We're all young and stupid. So young and stupid. Chomp, chomp. I go out drinking with all of my friends. <laughs> when I finish doing that, I go out drinking again. <laughs> I just gotta shut up. It's not funny. I just got a brand new car, man. 78 Hornet with 8 inch max. Sometimes I go cruising on the highway really fast. And I get a ticket. Cause I'm young and stupid, I'm so young and stupid, we're all young and stupid, I'm so young and stupid. Rock me, Greg! I'm semi-paralyzed from my neck to my hair. And sometimes I like to get really stoned and work the ride to the fair. I go drinking Friday nights down in the fire. Sometimes I like to sit in my car and set my beer farts on fire. Cause I'm young and stupid. We're all young and stupid. So young and stupid. Everybody is young and stupid. And we don't get around. Don't get around. We don't get around. Don't get around. We don't get around. Don't get around. We 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 don't get around. 
I ate Liberty Cream Cheese Bread. Please send ten dollars to me. Cream, Liberty Cream. Six twenty eight Avenue of the Americas, New York, New York. Make tomorrow a chunky tomorrow. So what's your name, man? Achilles. Oh. Achilles. Achilles. I thought I found, oh, we found your heel, I guess. <laughs> no, I just sorry. Are they filming this? You can edit that part out, eh? I'm sorry. Achilles part? We don't even have asses. <laughs> well, this is, uh, this is, no, what's his name, really? Oh, hi, over there. Achilles? Really? Really? You should get your Perfect. arrows out, come on. I thought you were killed at Troy, but <laughs> you're still here. So I guess you're a good pro boxer then, right? Eh? Achilles? Did you? Achilles! <laughs> <laughs> well, this, one, this, one, this one's for you, Achilles. <laughs> I'm as gay as can be. I'm a fruit fly. Don't patronize me, Achilles. I'm as gay as can be. I'm a fruit fly. Don't patronize me, Achilles. Poo. I started my orange and poured myself a sprinter. Put up my hair for the day. I called up some friends just to see if they'd like to swing my way. Achilles. 
kill him. I'm ashamed of me. Kill him. I'm a fruit fly. Don't patronize. Kill him. Why don't you patronize? Fruit fly. Don't patronize me. Yeah. Okay. Uh, that's for the fuck, man. Give him a round of applause. Yeah. Don't you people have to go to school? Isn't there a... Um, I'd just like to take this moment to thank the members of the uh, Bridge Competition Committee for doing such a great job. Uh, we, were down, uh, we were down on some of the bridges earlier today, and uh, they were a little small, but you know what with the way miniaturization is going, soon we'll all have cars about this big anyway. So good work, good luck, uh, and fuck you. <laughs> thank you. was a freedom rider. She didn't care if the whole world looked. Joan of Arc with the Lord to guide her. There was a sister who really cooked. Isadora was the first proper and her angel glad she showed up. And when the country was falling apart, Betsy Ross got it all sewed up. And then there's Vaughn. And then there's Vaughn. And there's Vaughn. And then there's Vaughn. And then there's Vaughn. And then there's Vaughn. Right on, Vaughn. What? Thanks for coming back. We'd like to uh, like to take a moment and actually introduce ourselves. Uh, my name's Jerry. I play the guitar. My name's Greg, and I play with small animals. <laughs> My name is uh, Sandra, and I <laughs> play the harp for the uh, European Philharmonic Orchestra. Yes. My name is Tesco, and I am a fourth lord of the seven seas of Tesculas. This is my peninsula. I am Jolie, my boy at the restaurant of my father's delights. I am Tizzo, master of small onions. <laughs> I am Trevor, king of screw-off bottle tops. I am Jonathan Peer, the man who looks in your window and goes <laughs> I am Fanecto, brother of the third lord of the seventh bun. I bring you freedom. It's only half past one, but our school day is already done. You ask me why it's such an early day, it's cause our vice principal just Away. Yeah. I would have been in gym right now. Thank you, thank you, Mr. Miles. With Mr. Cochran, that child molesting cow. Thank you, thank you, Mr. Miles. I didn't have my lab sheet done. You drop dead right on cue. The chem doesn't start till half past one. You drop dead at quarter to. Uh, one minute he was at his desk, making out a list of the day's detentions. Uh, Next minute he was on the floor, with Miles burst of bang from hypertension. Now we're all having lots of fun. Let's be on the lawn at half past one. No one around to give us shit, cause Ice Prince Miles just bought the biscuit. Yay! Well, I have a meeting in the auditorium. No way! Small get together in the broom closet. No way! A dollar and a slap in the face for No children. way! Thank you, thank you, thank you, Mr. That's my impression of John B. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. Well, Cherry's you. Jubilee. Whee! 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 Steamed mussels. Oh, fuck. They're really pissing me off. I can't fucking get the same thing. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck Stoned corn crackers. Oh, oh my God. God. <laughs> hey, Todd. Hey, hey, much. I was talking to the peanut butter the other day. Really? Uh, he's in a real jam. Oh, my God. <laughs> Min <laughs> minestrone. You know, Phil? I couldn't help but notice. That's a very small stroni you've got there. You love it! 
Ah, uh, you love it. <laughs> You're really, really a patented friend of the animals, aren't you? <laughs> Told him. <laughs> we like to do one. Uh, we'll do, we're going to do one last song. That's uh, it's a ballad, uh, so we don't want to bring it down. But we thought it'd be nice to end on a nice can top note. Can I just say something before we finish? You certainly can. No! <laughs> Thanks, Sean. You're welcome. <laughs> we'd uh, we'd like to do a song now that was written by an Irish uh, an Irish singer uh, called Christy Good Cookies. He's uh, <laughs> from Belfast, Ireland, and Sean Sean would like to sing a song uh, in, in Christy's style, a tribute to Christy Good Cookies. This is called When the Moon. Yeah, hurry up and get out. Quickly, 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 quickly. Someone hoop him in the nuts as he goes. Someone. Oh, he hooped himself in the nuts. How talented. That's hard to do. But thanks to the bridge competition. <laughs> and Irish People are hooping themselves in the nuts every day. <laughs> and you can help. <laughs> Ten ten dollars too. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> uh, we're playing at the Comedy Nest all this weekend too, and then we have uh, more stuff to our show. You should all come down and see it, okay? Yeah. Uh, yeah right. Yeah right. We're all going. Yeah. It costs money to get in there, Bob. <laughs> These are for important things like getting so drunk you shit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Wow. You, ever, you ever been so drunk that you, you have to shit and, and throw up at the same time? And Last you know, night, we opened up a big can of worms there, I guess. <laughs> and oh, they called it Kojak's. No, <laughs> 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 okay, okay. Yeah. Who loves you, baby? <laughs> this is called When the Moon by Mr. Christy Good Cookies. When the moon rises over the meadow And the grass is glistening with the dawn I'll come home and find you softly sleeping And I'll throw up and I'll pass out next to you When the moon rolls through the darkness the men have all gone to the bed. I'll be drawn at the pool with my body, and I'll kick all the teeth out of their head. Hey! I'll be back when summer's in the middle. Kidnapped me again. Yeah. Thanks very much for joining the news picks. Join the rest of your day. Goodbye.